hello everyone welcome back to my channel i am fola Sheyi, and judging by the title of this video i know you know why we are here i'm here to give you some healthy tips that you can use to put through during this amatan season we all know that amatan season comes with extra dryness especially for those with natural dry skin so i am here to give you some healthy tips what to do and what not to do and what to reduce concerning your skin during dry season if you're a returning subscriber thank you for coming back if you are yet to subscribe kindly do after this video if you're a new subscriber thank you for joining the community i am here to give you some tips that you can use to avoid this whitish flaky and old looking skin during amatan season especially if you are naturally dry skin one of the tips I'll be giving you is to avoid too much of hot water. I mean, there are this kind of hot water you use during the Amatan season that you can't even try during normal season. You understand that, that extra hot water. Kindly avoid this kind of water and instead use a warm water. I know it might not be easy because of the coldness of the hair and the environment, but you just have to avoid too much of hot water during a matan season because hot water tends to dry off excess oil on your skin 10 times faster than cold water so if to avoid this old looking skin and dry skin during a matan, you will need to avoid too much of hot water instead use warm water the second point on my list is to avoid harsh soaps soaps like nano white soaps like black soap tend to dry up your skin easily especially if you have a sensitive skin try and embrace moisturizing soaps this will surely help you during the amazon season my next tip is to avoid too much of exfoliation too much of scrubbing your skin during dry season will dry up your skin the more like it will aid the dryness so i would advise you to avoid any products that contains exfoliants soaps that contains exfoliants in fact avoid exfoliation during dry season trust me it won't help your skin the next tip is to get a good moisturizer like be generous with your moisturizer get a lightweight moisturizer oils that you can use during amatan season i made a video a couple of days ago on some kind of moisturizing oil that you can use on your skin directly or you can use with your lotion please get a lightweight moisturizer make use of shea butter make use of glycerin and some couples of healthy oil during this summertime season it will help you it will help your skin greatly another tip is to get a good sunscreen sunburn is very very prone during amatan season it's very very common during amatan season so make sure you get your sunscreen and apply it whenever you are going out for those that normally experience cracked feet chapped leaves and very severe dryness please try and use a good moisturizer like glycerin if you're experiencing this kind of dryness please use more of a good glycerin apply it on your on, on your on your legs on your feet on your hands before going out and if you have a chap lip uh, lips this dry lips during amatan season get a good chaplet that will moisturize or any lip moisturizer to avoid too much of cracked and uh, bruises on your lips if you are the type that experience this type of cracked feet during amatan season make sure you apply uh, a good shea butter on diluted shea butter immediately immediately you you come out of the of your bathroom when your le legs are still wet apply a generous amount of shea butter on your leg and wear a very thick socks this will moisturize your feet and keep it from being cracked some people even use uh, a cling film this kind of very lightweight nylon a cling film to wrap up their feet before wearing the socks this is another tip if you are very prone to a very uh, dry and cracked feet like this it will moisturize your feet and keep your leg safe if you enjoyed this video kindly give this video a thumbs up so that youtube will recommend it for others thank you for subscribing and see you next time